How is everybody doing tonight? Good. Yeah, I agree wholeheartedly. Because Santa has some weird things I want to get out there. Let me start by being as open as I can with you. Santa loves butt stuff. All right? But Santa hates the elf police. So every time the elf police pull him over, he likes to act real nervous and there's a bunch of hair on him in his rectum. Because the police don't want to search him, but he needs the human content for the elf content. <laughs> uh. It's tough out there. I don't watch a lot of TV. Uh, I'm working almost all the time for all of you. You're welcome. Uh, but when I do, uh, I like to flip through and just see what's coming on. Recently, I saw a show called Animal Wars. I was severely disappointed though. You hear a name like Animal Wars, you think like a rhino with Asperger's and a bunch of garbage in his house. <laughs> <laughs> like TV, it generally confuses me. I'm not gonna lie. Like, uh, I don't like the 700 Club. Um, not because I don't like Jesus or Pat Robertson. Uh, I'm just severely dyslexic and a huge James Bond fan. <laughs> it's always been tough for me. You know who's on my daughter list? Hipsters. Right? They look very similar, the couples. Like it looks like they dress the same. It looks like a cartoonist was asked to draw a couple in a haste. So yeah, give them the same shirt and the same pants and just throw boobs on them. <laughs> Take that, hipsters. <laughs> Hipsters are, are kind of weirding me out too because they get into more and more like old tiny things like twisty mustaches and vinyl records. Uh, I'm just waiting for them to start using the N word and say it's classic. <laughs> too much? <laughs> I'm Santa. <laughs> Do those. Oh, I'm good. I can't. My parole officer. Um, <laughs> it's water soluble. That's what I'm Recently I was driving around in my sleigh and I saw uh, the Kwanzaa sleigh and it had a bumper sticker on the back of it. It said, abortion stops with beating heart. I said, damn, that's long and sad. Someone could short it up and make it work, just abortion stops with beating and hit it right there. <laughs> Sands gave all of you a copy of Freakonomics for Christmas. <laughs> you should read that. <laughs> <laughs> swimmingly, swimmingly. My wife thinks I'm weird. I have to constantly remind her that I'm not kill you and hide your body weird. I'm wearing your nightgown and your high heels when you're out of town weird. She comes home and she's like, I didn't stretch this out. My feet don't sweat this much. No, it's me. Crawling around the house like the principal from Modern Real Monsters. Yeah. Santa is Nickelodeon heavy tonight. The reason why Santa doesn't believe in God, it's a simple reason, cat dog. <laughs> but loving God would put those two mortal enemies together, am I right? One loyal to a fault, the other curious. One loves the taste of fish, the other loves the taste of the shit of the one that eats the fish. <laughs> My dog eats cat shit all the time. If she was attached to a cat, it would literally get nothing done. And I don't mean like Instagram, this is literally the best day ever. I mean like they would n get nothing done. Excitement, entertainment, Santa, you're welcome. Thank you, thank you. That's an applause break, sure, sure it is. Go ahead, feel good about yourselves, I don't. <laughs> I've got a food problem, okay? Could anyone know that about Santa? Yeah, he does, I do. But like, I, I don't know, you can't treat a food problem like you treat a drug problem, but you can't be like, Santa, just stop eating. Right? You, you can't. I need to eat. That's like telling a crackhead, hey guy, here's how it's going to work. You smoke crack five times a day, keep it tight, keep it short, make it work for you. No. Thank you. I know how my intervention's going to go, right? It's not going to be me in the bathroom booting heroin. It's going to be me in the bathroom eating as many double cheeseburgers as I can before my parents take me to fat camp. <laughs> That's right, Sam has parents. They're very old. <laughs> Gene Krupen is my dad. Um, that's a drummer joke! Yeah! Woo! You couldn't hear it. It's there. I felt it. It was very really much spiritual. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. You know, my penis and I have confidence problems. Okay? Mostly because before I met my wife, all my ex-girlfriends were brutal to me. They'd say, like, Santa, your dick's too short. 
or Santa, you come too quick. I'd say, whoa, 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 short dick, come too quick. Uh, ladies, I'm just built for anal sex, that's all that is. It's a painless procedure, my birthday is just maybe 20 seconds tops, and I do all of the crying. My penis, this is what I call the Santa penis block of my act, so hang with me. My penis and I have a little old party of shame. Hear me out. I'm fat, he's thin, and we're always in trouble. <laughs> yeah, you're welcome. God, of course the guy wearing sunglasses inside enjoys a penis and a little old party of He says, Richmond, Brandon, you gotta expect this kind of shit. <laughs> uh, but I don't know, I, 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 I've been trying to get out there to date. Um, I, I met a, a nice girl on Tinder, we went on a date, and I was getting late. I yawned, uh, it didn't, didn't cover my mouth, and she immediately jammed um, two fingers down my throat. I was like, what the hell is that? And she's like, it's really rude to yawn and not cover your mouth. It's really rude to stick your fingers down my throat. <laughs> You're not my dance mom, so stop it. <laughs> Sorry, guys. See, I tell that joke because it hits home for me. I was little Mr. Top Heavy from 1992 to 1996. My mom and I toured the entire East Coast. She's a monster. <laughs> uh, guys, are you having a good time tonight? Yeah. That's wonderful. That is just wonderful. Do you guys uh, know why Garfield um, hated Mondays? Uh, type 2 diabetes. You don't feed a cat lasagna, John. <laughs> Real talk. God, God, take that, Jesus. Guys, I'll leave you with this. Uh, I've been progressively getting into weirder and weirder porn. I started out pretty normal, I guess kind of normal. Uh, just with Eskimo kissing. It's two people rubbing their noses together. Uh, now I'm into Eskimo bukkake. It's when six dudes stand around one girl and just sneeze on her over and over and over again. I'm sorry, I was rolling a cigarette. That was great. <laughs> Thanks, Dad. You guys have a wonderful week.